This is a company that specializes in uh, processing of fruits and vegetables. We are based in Tarakanithi County, working with small older farmers from Meru, Tarakanithi, Embu and Kitui counties. Uh, this is a company that was started back in 2009 with one employee. Currently we are over 40 employees working at this processing facility. And what uh, we do is uh, we buy produce from smallholder farmers. The farmers were not able to actually access the markets uh, because of their low production. We buy from them. Currently we have 3,000 farmers that we are working with in the region. And uh, once we buy this uh, produce, we deliver it to our factory. We process it through drying. We use a natural way of drying using solar drying technology where we dry them and increase the shelf life of these uh, fruits and vegetables. If you look at the fruits and vegetables, when they are fresh, the shelf life is just five to six days for fruits and only three days for vegetables. But once you dry them, you're able to keep them for a whole year or more than one year. So that is how we add value to our produce, which reduces the post-harvest losses from the farms and also creates value of the produce that we are selling in the market. When we dry this produce, we supply both bulk and retail markets. We sell in uh, packed small packs and we also sell in bulk packs, both for the local and export markets. On matters concerning the issues of climate, all of us are aware that there is a huge challenge to the farming because of the change in climate. But the kind of crops that we're encouraging our farmers to farm are those uh, crops that are able to actually do well even uh, in drought. For example, mango is a crop that does well even in drought. And also we're encouraging the farmers also to, uh, to produce uh, short-term crops like the African indigenous vegetables. These are crops that even with minimal rain, the farmer is able to have it ready and produce. So we are really promoting a commercialization of African indigenous vegetables and fruits that are able to adapt to the to the, to the climate, as well as cereals that we use for making the porridge flour. Currently, the farmers that we have worked with, we have been able to create market for them because these are farmers that initially, they would not be favored when it comes to buying because they have low volumes because of the sizes of land. But we have been able to aggregate these farmers together, we buy from them, we, we collect at the aggregation centers and we deliver them uh, as a bulk to the facility. Sisi ni wakulima wandogo wandogo na tunafurahi tunafurahi asili ta de dry kwa sababu ana ina tu, tunafaidika kutoka naye ananunua maembe sweet potatoes butternut vegetables tukivuna tunaisanya pamoja eh, sweet and dry, and dry ana uh, anatunuria Alafu hayo mapato tuna inatusaidia sana kujiendeleza bere. Pata nikupata hizo pesa na dipia watoto sure na kukula kwa nyumba. Mahitaji ya nyumba yani. Uh, since I became a client to KCIC, I've been able to actually work on my business strategy and uh, even be able to make contacts uh, with the partners and even other buyers that uh, have been able to see the work we are doing and a lot of support especially on issues of uh, promoting our brand out there in the market. The message I would have for KCIC is to actually support these uh, cottage uh, facilities because through these facilities we are able to grow uh, from the start when the first team visited us uh, and where we are within a period of just one year because of that support and contacts that we are receiving we've been able to expand so i would urge that kcic actually engages more upcoming enterprises and especially industrialization in the in the rural areas because this is the solution to addressing our wastage in the farms and even creating market for the farmers <music>